Out of more than 24 million Algerian voters, only about five and a half million lodged a ballot at Saturday's polls. A record low turnout, with more than a million invalid votes cast, after supporters of the Herak mass protest movement urged a boycott. That hasn't stopped the Electoral Commission from hailing it as a democratic success. Before, the voter gave his vote but did not choose. But today, thanks to the blessed Hirak of February 22nd, as well as the democratic values established by the presidential elections of December 12th and the constitution of November 2020, the voter now has a voice. In the first legislative election since autocratic former president Abdelaziz Bouteflika was forced out in 2019, his party, the FLN, emerged the winner, albeit with a reduced number of seats. Independents won the second biggest number, while the moderate Islamist party, MSP, came third. The Herak movement has refused to take part in any election, including the 2019 presidential poll that installed Bouteflika's replacement, Abdel Majid Tebboune, because they say real power is still in the hands of the military establishment. I won't vote because nothing will change. Nothing at all. The twice-weekly Hirak demonstrations for reform were effectively banned last month, and two prominent journalists were detained on the eve of the election before being released over the weekend.